Hey, hey, it's NSB time. So uh, the last time uh, we got the uh, Super B out and we drove it down the road and we did that final tuning on it, got it running great. Uh, coming back and we got back, it's really, the rear end in it is starting to sing pretty hard. Uh, when I say sing, like if you give it gas, it kind of gives me some growl. And then when I let off, it's giving me growl. If you coast, it seems to be okay. So I feel like I'm just getting a lot of backlash or something. Something's moving on it. So right now I need to get the car, bring it in, put it up on the lift, and get the gear yanked out of it. And we'll get it set up in the fixture over here, and we'll go through and check it out, see what's going on with it. So uh, that's what we're doing. Putting a drain plug in, which eight and three quarter didn't come with, when you go let the fluid out, it pulsates like it's getting not getting no air. That's because the valve up top, up here, that keeps the water. Up here, that keeps the water from going in. That's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to cap off so nothing goes in. It's got like a spring. But I found that if you just loosen that bolt. and take it loose, then it pours right on out. Steady stream. So I took the gear out and put it up here. So far, I don't see nothing wrong with the backlash. I got my dial indicator on it. I'm running right at 11. That was my in play. This was really easy to turn and tall john said about 25 inch pounds to turn that so i did tighten the nut up a little bit and we're a little high we're about 45 inch pounds to turn it that's the only thing adjustment i've done on i'm gonna put it back in and see what it does as you can see the pattern on the let me come over where we can see this a little better as you can see the 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 pattern is all the way across the gear and it's going all the way down just a little bit over three quarters of the gear. There's just a little black stripe there that's not hitting yet. As the gear wears, it goes in deeper. So that should be about right. I'm getting full contact. So I don't know why this gear was raising hell. We'll find out when I put it back in. All right, I swapped over on cameras and uh, hey, look who come to visit. <laughs> Getting in this thing. Oh, come on, which key we got here? Too many keys on the ring. All right. Here we go. Yeah. 
expecting it to be a short trip. It's going to be a short trip anyway. I hope it's a good short trip. Uh oh, I'm running over something back here. I got the bearing load a little too much. your little hot foot. Yeah, well, 
let's see, I gotta get the lawnmower in next and work on it because my grass is getting tall and for some reason the blades ain't wanting to stay on. So that's my next job, so let me pull this over here. Man, I don't like that rear end clutches. They still want to pop a little bit sometimes in a turn. They are brand new, they'll wear in. Supposed to rain sometime today, so I'll probably be bringing this back in the garage. But that's what I gotta work on, the damn lawnmower. Yep. You know, I don't know, I don't think I've ever showed everybody, but you know, I got this pool pump here. And I've got this tank and then this tank down here. What these tanks are is for hydro dipping. I do uh, quite a bit of hydro dipping. And since I built this garage and moved all this over, I haven't officially got them all running, filled back up where I can use them. Plus I got all this crap in the way. But I'm fixing to clear that out. So coming down the pike on video, uh, I'm going to do some hydro dipping, especially the... 66 uh, Belvedere them are the if you look over here That's the two bumpers for it the back bumper and the front bumper I'm gonna strip them down and paint them and then I'm gonna Dip them in my big tank and uh, I'll show everybody as I dip them I'm gonna do them like I did the dart and I'm gonna do them in carbon fiber But uh, super B seems to be doing pretty good uh, if the rear ends does start raising hell again, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to have to put something else in it. But uh, right now, I think it'll make a, a quarter mile pass the way it is. So next step would be bringing it in, getting my slicks put on, and hopefully take it to the track because uh, we are planning on taking the uh, the dart. So I'm going to take my Super B when we go and, and uh, see what goes on with it. So uh, that should take care of this video. Uh, uh oh, Betty White just fell down. I think she's been drinking. So that'd be all for this video. Uh, don't forget to like us, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Till next time.